Can't go to the lab or office now? Self-petition your green card. Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel from New Weiming Law Group. Have you ever heard this famous line from the movie Back to the Future? Your future has not been written yet. No one's has. Your future is whatever you make it, so make it a good one. Let's talk about this today. As of now, because of the COVID-19 pandemic, many individuals, including graduate students, postdocs, visiting scholars, and professionals cannot go to work. For example, researchers in biology, chemistry, physics, material science, computer science, data science, engineering, and many other fields cannot go to their laboratories or office buildings as they used to, and this can also affect their jobs and visa status in the long run. This may be exactly your situation right now. Now, how best to deal with this problem? Yesterday, we uploaded a recording on unemployment and maintaining visa status in the U.S., which provides information for not only H-1B visa holders, but also those holding F-1, F-1 OPT, J-1, O-1, L-1, and other visas in the United States. Check it out on our YouTube channel. Meanwhile, while you are staying home and probably have more time than before, you really should seriously consider self-petition green cards such as National Interest Waiver NIW, which does not require employer sponsorship, does not require you to already have a work visa or long-term job offer in the United States, does not require a PhD degree, and does not even require you to stay in the U.S. in the upcoming months or years. You can also apply from abroad, outside the United States, but if you are already in the U.S., have spent years here and invested a lot during the past years, then, no matter where you go, whatever you do, you can learn more about NIW, complete your application, and submit promptly to the USCIS. This is for your own benefit. We speak from our own experience. The managing attorney in our law firm, Dr. Tsai, received his own green card through NIW. He applied NIW while a graduate student at the University of Maryland. Back then, he had only a bachelor's degree, was busy working in the chemistry laboratory with only a couple publications, not many citations to his published papers, and had no review experience. However, his NIW application, based on research works done in the U.S., was subsequently approved. Besides Dr. Tsai at New Weiming Law Group, we also have multiple specialists who have PhD degrees in science, abundant research and writing experience, and personal experience in obtaining U.S. green cards through self-petition. We have already helped thousands of students, researchers, engineers, and professionals. For more information about the detailed requirements for NIW and for sample case summaries, please check out our YouTube videos or contact us. It often takes only a short time period starting from scratch to completion and submission of your NIW application. If you were born outside of mainland China and India, you and your family members can also submit I-485 Adjustment of Status application together with NIW, which allows your whole family to stay in the U.S. legally without any other visa. For frequently asked questions such as, do I qualify for NIW approval? How much will it cost me? What kind of documents are needed for the application? How do I add my family members? How do I arrange my job change in international travel? How do I increase the likelihood of a speedy approval? You can email us at info at nwmlaw.com to get a free evaluation and summary of recently approved cases for your reference. Many graduate students, postdocs, researchers, engineers, and professionals have told us in the past that, oh, I really want to apply the green card, but I am so busy with work. I simply do not have the time to do this since I need to come to my laboratory or my office every day. Well, now everything has come to a sudden pause and you are probably not even allowed to go to your lab, classroom, or office. Now is the perfect time to stop procrastination and take some action. In summary, if you are staying home, if you cannot go to the lab, classroom, or office building, if you worry about visa status, career, future employment, and your future in the United States, learn about NIW and take action. And remember, your future has not been written yet. No one's has. Your future is whatever you make it, so make it a good one. Thank you and best wishes.